The 30th edition of the popular Catch Junior Tennis Tournament served off in Takarigua this morning at the National Racquet Center, where upwards of 200 participants are taking part. The event, which normally ends by today, will see one of its latest finishes, but that has not dampened spirits, and the event is expected to be highly competitive in the various age groups. Among those taking part and expected to vie for top honors are Cameron Wong, Solange Skeen, Aidan Carter, and Nabil Mohammed, all back to defend their respective titles from one year ago. And to develop the youth, especially in light of what has been happening in our country, you know. So we know that there have not been a lot of companies that have had this kind of lengthy sponsorship, and we are very proud to stand here and say that we have sponsored the Tennis Association and this National Junior Championship for the past 30 years. She was thrilled with the response to the tournament again this year, as the sport of tennis continues to grow. It's part of a bigger four-year strategic plan, which is awaiting government approval as the ITF is already on board with the local tennis association to make TT the hub for the sport in the region. Next month, um, we're going to have something that has never happened here, of course, or even in this part of the world, where we're going to be having the first ever female professional tennis tournament right here at this facility in Trinidad and Tobago. Right? And this is sponsored, of course, by the ITF. Um, and it's part of our vision to make here the regional center for tennis and tennis development. What we are trying to do is produce a top 150 player. This is world rank player by the year 2026.